In this lesson, I'll show you how to synthetically divide when the denominator is 2x minus 3. In our previous examples, we looked at divisors that were x minus 4, and they didn't have this leading coefficient of 2. So what do we do in this case? That being said, we're expected to calculate this polynomial divided by 2x minus 3 using synthetic division. Let's begin by writing out the coefficients associated with each of these terms in this cubic expression here. So we have 2, the coefficient of this term is 1, the coefficient of that term is negative 22, and that constant is 20. Furthermore, we need to introduce this division box here, and the number that gets placed into there is found by setting that expression equal to 0. So if we have 2x minus 3 equal to 0, solving for x, we bring that 3 over, we get positive 3. Then dividing both sides by 2 gives us the value of x, which we're looking for, and that gets placed right there. So 3 over 2. Notice the leading coefficient is 2. We will rewrite that underneath. And we'll take this value of 3 over 2 and multiply it to this 2. 3 over 2 times 2 makes 3. And we'll place that value underneath this 1. Now we will add 1 plus 3, that makes 4. Again, we'll take 3 over 2 and multiply it to 4. 3 over 2 times 4 gives us a value of 6. Now if you're weak with that, you can always use your calculator. But by now you should be able to multiply fractions and integers quite quickly. Again, we have negative 22 plus 6, and that's negative 16. 3 over 2 times negative 16. That makes negative 24. Adding 20 and negative 24 together combines to negative 4. So the way we write down our answer is by saying 2x to the power of 2. Notice that we started off with a cubic, so our final answer should be a quadratic. 2x to the power of 2, notice that this 2 and that 2 correlate, plus 4x minus 16, that's your brand new constant, and this value is considered the remainder. The way you write that is you would say plus, and in parentheses, negative 4, and you see this value? We write it down as x minus 3 over 2. And the reason why we write down minus 3 over 2 is because if we were to set this equal to 0, we would end up with positive 3 over 2, and that's the number that we had here. If you have this question in your textbook, the answers in the back might even write it out as, without these parentheses, that negative would be placed right here, and you don't need the parentheses either. And there you have it. That is how to synthetically divide when the denominator is 2x minus 3.